Shaber 1000 here. Today we're going to be cooking up a corned beef brisket. We're actually going to be doing two of them in the crock pot. Should be pretty easy. I've only made them in a fire in a pit so we're going to stick them in the crock pot. We'll see what happens. Stay tuned. Okay guys, so we got, like I said, two of them here. This one's a little over two and a half pounds, 2.640. And this one here is a little under two pounds, 1.950 pounds. So we're looking at a little over four pounds here. I've seen a guy on YouTube doing this. He stuck it in the crock pot, um, just, just dry didn't didn't put anything no water or anything like that and it made its own juices which I will probably be making some gravy out of but anyway let's go ahead and open this up and it comes with these little seasoning package packets here um, but that guy said he didn't like them so, I'm not sure if I want to use them or not. You know, everybody's taste this is a little different. See, it comes with these little packets here. Um, I might. I, I might throw it in there. What the heck, right? All right. He didn't, uh, he didn't wash his off or nothing. He just seasoned it and uh, stuck it in stuck it in the crock pot so that's, that's pretty much what we're going to do uh, you can trim the fat off uh, but I'm not going to that guy didn't he said simply because he didn't want to but he said he usually does but I think see when that fat renders down that gives you juices too, so. Right. What I am gonna do, there's a lot of brine on here. I am going to rinse them off a little bit. Well, <laughs> you'll see a lot of meat. It, they, they will shrink up a little too, so. All right, now, I'm going to dry my hands off and I'm going to get you over here at the crock pot. Okay guys, so what you're going to want to do, you always want to put the fat side up, but since we're going to season these, um, I'm going to season this side and then I'll flip it over. The only thing I'm going to use in my own is lemon pepper and this uh, steak seasoning from Badia. Badia? Why is this camera not focusing here lately? Okay, so the seasoning packets. You want to try them? I think there's just pepper, isn't it? I don't know what it is. I don't know if there's any sugar in these. Yeah, I think there is. It just looks like there's peppers. I don't think there's any sugar in these. Yeah. Well, you try them out there. Well, if there is, there's probably not enough in there to hurt them. <laughs> Well, let's go ahead and cut these open. There's doesn't anything open. <laughs> I do the same thing with the meat. Yeah. This is a brisket. So, I'll save the rest of this for the other side. Like I said, we are going to flip that over. So we're going to put some lemon pepper on there. Just like that. Now, we're going to flip it over and we're going to do the same thing to this side. And we're going to do the same thing to the other 
uh, piece of meat and then we're going to turn this on so let me go ahead and do that so you don't get bored this is going to be a pretty quick video and um, then it's going to be kind of like the longest video I ever made that's the shortest because this is going to take 10 to 12 hours <laughs> so but it's going to be a short video but that's why I say it's going to be the longest but the the shortest longest video I ever made so I'm gonna do that to the other piece of meat we'll come back and we'll turn this on okay guys that's pretty much it for about 10 or 12 hours I'm just gonna put the lid on now, like I said this is what this guy did I I don't know I didn't catch his channel name or anything like that and I'm sorry but like I said this is not my recipe technically it's really not a recipe it's just throwing some stuff in a pan on a pot and letting it cook okay so what we're going to do is we're going to put this on low now how do I turn it on is that it I don't know where no I mean I put it on low is that it is there an yeah. on button no you just push the low and there should be a rip up there is so it's on yeah okay so we're going to let this cook 10 to 12 hours See you guys tomorrow afternoon. Okay guys, this is what we got so far. It's been 10 hours. So we started this, let's see, it's 11.47 a.m. now. So we started this at uh, 1.47 a.m. So I'm gonna shut this off. And I'm gonna set the kitchen timer for 60 minutes. Okay, so now we're going to let it rest for an hour and we'll come back to it and check it. Okay, everyone, we've let it rest for an hour. Um, I told you the wrong time. I forgot about the time change that last night, you know, spring forward. Uh, everything sets itself except for the stove. The stove says 1250. Now it's actually. 150 so let's go ahead and take this off and get one of these out of here wow hopefully it doesn't fall apart on me right, there we go let's set it over here on my I don't have a big fancy plate guys, I'm sorry. Look at that. Okay, now, back on. Now let's bring you over here and we're gonna cut this. Okay, now, wow, isn't that nice? Okay, I wanna make sure I go against the green so it'll be more tender, I'm gonna cut it this way. Uh, let me zoom you in here a little bit. Now, let's see how this came out. Ooh, that is tender. Believe me, guys, this knife is not sharp. Look at that. This is, this would be great on Reuben sandwiches. Look at that. Look how tender that brisket is. Wow. Okay, Monkey's not here to try it because she ran to the store to get some potatoes. We're going to boil potatoes with this. But I'm going to give it a shot. And then when she comes in, I'll let her try it. See what she thinks of it. So let me get you spun around here. Okay, here we go. Check it out. How nice that is. Alright, let's give it a shot. <laughs> oh my gosh. It just melted away. It's gone. Um, so like I said, the longest short video I've ever made was this. So in total it was 11 hours, because I let it rest for an hour. So, let's give it one more shot here and then we'll, when Monkey gets back we'll let her try it. Mmm. Mm. Oh, this is so good. This, this would be great on a sandwich. Okay. 
In the meantime, I have been challenged to a barbecue grill build off by Papito's Casa de Welding. I'm going to be doing a video on that and we'll let you guys know more um, like of the timeline, more of the details as they come out. So the next video that I'm going to post will be about that. So uh, I'm not sure about the details yet. We're still kind of working that out. But so stay tuned for that video. Huge shout out to him, which will be in the next video. And link to his channel and everything will be in the next video. So it's going to be a lot of fun. This is going to be a blast. I've <laughs> never been challenged to a build off before, but this guy is good. So I'm going to have to really use this up here more than this here to beat this guy. So <laughs> great guy. He's freaking awesome, guys. So anyway, let's let Monkey get back. And uh, when she gets back, we'll let her try it. So stick around. Okay, guys, we got Monkey back from the store. She's yep. sitting here getting ready to try this. She don't ever remember having corned beef, so. Mm -mm. She's in for a treat. Give it a shot, Monk. All right. That's pretty good. Not bad. Not bad? Mm -mm. Mm. Okay. Nice flavor. Mm -hmm. It's tender. Very it's tender. Now it's in your mouth. Mm -hmm. Very. I don't know what it tastes like. Because I've already tried it. Did you? Yeah, so did your mom. Oh, she I did? I took her in a piece. Did she like it? <laughs> yeah. No, my mom loves food, but if it's really... he, She loves your food, too. So. What do you think of it? Yeah, it's good. Very good. Yeah, I eat this. And it was something different. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very good. Nice. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Monk. You're welcome. Okay, guys. So, so far it's a hit. And it's just, uh, like I said... The longest short video I ever made. Very nice. Mm. Mm -hmm. Monk. She gave me two thumbs up. Yeah. Monkey says she's out. Monkey says she's out. <laughs> For now. For now. She's ready to eat. I gotta boil some potatoes, so. Mm -hmm. Thanks for watching guys, appreciate it. Share with the mental man legend. Don't forget to check out Monkey 1000 channel and we'll see y'all in the next one. So, have a great week coming up, and if you haven't already, set your clocks ahead. So, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye, guys. Take care. <laughs>